at all. The, this is general information about, because I know I mentioned it in one of my videos that, okay, we could figure out all the notes on the fingerboard. Well, we're, I'm going to give you a little formula that I used when, you know, when I was starting out. <clears throat> we know the C scale. We know that it has two and a half and three and a half steps. All right. Now, what we're going to be doing is remember what we did this and I said, well, C to D is one step, D to E is one step, E to F is a half step. You remember that, that we did that? And then with the minor scales, we also had the different steps. Well, what happens here is we can figure out all the natural notes on the guitar using the C scale. Now, how do we do that? All right, let's start with the E. Okay, the way we figure this out is we go to E and we say E to F is how far? It's a half step. All right, you should know that. That's why you don't see in the half and the ones in there right now because I'm expecting that you know this, but I will explain it. E to F is a half step. Open is a half step. All right. Now, once we know this, E, F, we know that F to G is a whole step. G to A, the distance is a whole step or two frets. A to B is two frets, right? B to C is a half step or one fret. C to D, one step. D to E, one step. Now remember, we started on the E. Half step, whole step, whole step, whole step, half step. Whole, just a whole step, whole step, okay? What it is, is whatever note we start on, like here it's the A, you go to the scale where you have your formula, because you should have this written down someplace. You know A to B is what? It's a whole step. A opened, whole step. B to C, what's the distance? Half step. Now we start back, C to D, whole step, D to E, whole step, E to F. So whatever string we want to know all the natural note names, that's how you do it. Okay? I know, might be a little confusing, so we'll go over, let's take the G. Start on the G, and again, remember, we're in C. We're in the key of C, all right? In other words, we don't have any sharps or flats. So, if we're gonna start on G, okay, what's the distance between G and A? A whole step. What's the distance between A and B? A whole step. B and C, now we know it's a half step. C to D, whole step. D to E, whole step. E to F, half step. F to G, whole step. Okay? What this is, and think about this now. When we have a open string, all right, in this case E, let's say we want to play the open string flat. How are we going to find that? Well, if you know C to D is a whole step, D to E, whoa. Same note. So if we want a whole string flat, we just okay. This might look familiar because those that have the Mel Bay book, and usually any guitar book, it'll have the way to tune the guitar. That you know the the fifth fret is the string, the the high st the string here, the E string. When you go above that string. The fifth fret 
is the same note, unless you're on the B string. On the B string, it's the fourth fret. But again, you could figure out all your natural notes using a C scale. This is just a little information thing. You know, if you do have a little trouble understanding it, please, you know, just in the comments below, mention it, and I'd be more than happy to explain it again. All right? But that's how you figure out all the notes, natural notes. Very important. All your natural notes on the guitar. All right? D, D to E. Whole step, E to F, half step, F to G, whole step, whole step, whole step. As you can see, everything's arithmetic. It's the formula. Once you know, in this case, the major scale, and you know that two and a half, three and a half steps, you could figure out every note on the guitar. In this case, we're using the C scale to figure out every natural note. All right? That's all we're going to do today about the scales. Again, this is just a general information type of, uh, you know, I don't, wouldn't even call it a lesson. I would just say for your information. All right? Comments below. If you like what you hear, give me the thumbs. Please subscribe. All right? And, oh, hope everybody has a nice holiday. that the holidays will be coming up real, real, real soon. All right? Take care. Enjoy your day.